What is going on guys? Welcome back to the channel and I appreciate you being here. The weekly update from Bungie has not long been posted and there's some interesting aspects to talk about that definitely is. But before we get into that people, if you want to win some epic loot, simply drop a like on this video, leave a comment down below and join my Discord server linked within the video description. I have exclusive emblem codes, sparrow codes and gift cards to give away. Okay, so the main thing behind this update is recapping on the blog from a few days back on the state of Destiny 2. But they also talk about the stream, what was supposed supposed to be coming this past Wednesday. Now while it has been cancelled, they do give us this mini teaser trailer which reveals a few new armour and weapon pieces definitely worth looking at. Check it out people. If the Vex succeed, it's the end of everything. Anywhere we can stop them, we must. So damn! Now I will obviously use my eagle eyes and bring you guys a breakdown of the trailer, uh, but that will be for another day. But I spotted some great loot in that trailer, I really did, but what did you spot? Let me know down below. Now the rest of the weekly update concentrates on server maintenance coming on December 1st to prep us for the Curse of Osiris DLC install. They also mentioned the preload storage requirements for the DLC. On PlayStation it's 88GB, on PC it's 68GB, and on Xbox Xbox it's 44 gigabytes so get the lean old games people if you don't have the space they also mentioned the weekly reset time change and give us a list of the new time zones across the globe hopefully people your time zone is stated here but yeah guys that's more or less it besides one other thing and that's the main image for this weekly update post. We see three guardians hold what have to be new exotics. On the left we have that solar trace rifle, yet to be named. In the centre we have a titan holding the colony, which is that epic looking grenade launcher which shoots them kind of mini spider robot things that chase you around the map. I can't wait to use that. And on the right we have this hunter holding what looks to be a red death hand cannon. This thing looks amazing, people, it seriously does. Now, the Red Death at one stage for me, uh, it was such a great, great weapon, and its design, in my opinion, still to this day, is one of the best we've ever seen in the entire course of Destiny 1 and 2. But this hand cannon, dare I say it, looks even better. I cannot wait to learn more about this and find out what exactly this thing is and what it's called. But yes, guys, just a quick video recapping on the things from this weekly update post. Let me know what you think about things I've covered in today's video. Thanks as always for stopping by if you're new around here and enjoy daily Destiny videos. Be sure to subscribe and hopefully people I will see you on that next one. Always in the wrong.